This tile screen is so nice. I love it. <laughs> <coughs> oh god. My voice. Let's get started, shall we? I don't actually remember what we were doing exactly. I know we're going somewhere, but... Go deeper into the Great Forest, into the area known as the Ashen Forest. I'm told there's a village in that area. That's inhabitants may know something about the Mask of the Sun, it'll deal with condition. Okay. Um, can I take a look at the map? Okay. So where would this place be? Somewhere we haven't been, probably. Normally those like be a, there'd be like a flag showing me where it is, right? Or am I going crazy? Maybe it's like here? There seems to be some like area over here. But I'm not 100% sure. Where the uh... Where the place is. The Ashen Forest. Well, maybe I'll look like over here first. Cause there's like a little area to the left I can go. I don't know if I can actually like run up here though. Doesn't look like it. I don't know if I can ever go through this area, actually, but maybe I'll find out eventually. There's definitely something over here. I don't know how to get there, though. Alright, maybe it looks like I can go from here. <clears throat> I guess I'll just have to be, have to look, keep an eye out for the Ashen Forest. I genuinely have no idea where it is. But this is the area we want to explore. Cable Mountain. I don't think this is Ashen Forest. But it's not higher level than us. Let's see if I remember how to play this game. This is what happens when I don't play a game for like five or six days. I was a bit busy this week. Gemulon? It kind of reminds me of a chameleon. It's probably based off of one at least. This is a really interesting track. <laughs> Doesn't sound like uh, the usual, usual like, exploration theme for use. So I think this is what we were trying to get to earlier, from down there, yeah. I guess this is maybe just hinting at there being something over here. Which is kind of cool, I think. I really like playing Kalilika for some reason. Oh my god, it's Mr. Stowe, my god. What's up, bro? Hello, Sonnens. I am doing pretty good. I woke up pretty early today, so I might get tired a bit earlier than normal today, but we'll see. We'll see how long I go for. But otherwise, uh, everything's going great, actually. Uh, I finally fixed my sleep schedule a little bit. And... I... I did a lot of tail stuff this week, which I'm very, very happy about and excited to 
<laughs> Excited to upload eventually. Chillin' staying on the hygiene grind, nice. Okay, well, what do you mean by like hygiene grind? Like, what, 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 what's your like routine? <laughs> My hygiene is like very basic. I like <laughs> I like wash my face in the morning. I brush my teeth, take a shower. Maybe I should uh maybe I should pay more attention to it. Shower before and after work, the other applies here in my service, I see, I see. Doing alright, bit tired from the pup, but good, nice. Help, um, help you on the uh, Have a good time. <laughs> memory of Celsetta, even. Promolock? Where, where was Promolock? Was Promolock... East... Hmm... No, I I, sw I swear we were at Promo Luck before. It's not in this game. P3 session got cancelled, so that's why I get tune in. Nice. More viewership for me. <laughs> Just kidding, I don't really care about it. That's too much. But it's nice to have people to chat too. I think they might be onto at all. <laughs> Unfortunately, I think he's realized that he's cute. Unlucky. He's gonna manipulate you. serious this time around. Ow, oh my god. Hmm, what's the end of the path here? I'm heavy. Let's see, let's see. Where's my boy? 
Mr. Durin. It looks like these guys don't get XP when they're um, out of the party, huh? <laughs> Maybe, maybe not good to just use one party only then. Alright, we'll, we'll throw in these guys. The male party. There's another path down here, kid. I was hoping this would be the right way to go in this game. But I'm not sure exactly where the Ashen Forest is, because I don't remember what they were telling me, like what direction to go in. So I'm just kind of wandering around. But I haven't been to this area yet, so hopefully I'm going the right direction. Might be a reduced XP deal. I see, I see. That would make more sense. How'd I get in here? Let me out! <laughs> Alright, you know what? Let's go do this. Gold ore. Nice. I should probably check what that uh, tree thing does too. Chain SP, that's pretty good. We'll do it. We'll rock it. Seems pretty good. Our mastered rising edge. Oh, that was kind of cool, actually. Redstone. Is this just like an optional area? Oh no, 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 there's something here. Oh, I went the right way. Maybe. Or maybe not. Maybe it's just a campsite. Adel appeared to be out of stamina. That never happens. It's L deal. Hmm. <laughs> oh, that's when he, um. <laughs> So I guess this is where Adol got blasted and lost his gear, I guess? <laughs> it's nothing to worry about. I'm glad I'm going the right way, because I had no idea if I was. Oh wow, there's some memory fragments. Like over here. I don't know how I would get to them. Maybe I just go like around here? What are these red ones, by the way? So many questions. I've never seen a red memory before. Maybe I should go to it to find out. There we go. Ashen. There's no music. Okay, I can't even get over there yet. I guess we're not going this way. <clears throat> this kind of reminds me of like the Metroid run. Like, uh, I think it's called like Shine Spark in Metroid.
Formalock is the town where he heard of Anisteria and where he returned after a few years. Okay, I see. So that's where he came from in the original East. I see, I see. I remember hearing it, but I didn't remember what exactly it was. Lighting strike. That seems pretty good. I'll get her a jawbreaker. Nope. Maybe did I not get rid of it? Oh no. I think I replaced jawbreaker with jawbreaker is what I did. That seems pretty good. There we go. That was pretty cool. Wild assault. I'm getting so many. I'm getting so many skills on Duran. It decreased your health when you used it. Really, that's crazy. Not that I'm a Metroid player, so I wouldn't know anything. Oh my god, that's kind of cool. Actually, Shine Spark is a <clears throat> reference to like a uh, manga slash anime series I really like called Getter Robo. It's super old. Where, but basically, the Getter there's a, there's a mecha called the Getter Dragon, and it's it's like strongest move is the Shine Spark. <laughs> Random trivia. That's like the one Metroid thing I know because uh, <laughs> it references something I like. Status effect. I'm not sure exactly what it is. The aerial slash rider right feels really nice. Maybe I'll get rid of rising slash because I think rising. I mean rising edge, because rising slash feels a lot better. I think. Metro is inspired by the alien movies. Oh, really? I actually didn't know that. <laughs> but it makes it makes sense. Let me go. I got misfortune status. What does that even mean? Just unlucky. This is rare. Right. Osma's going back on the bench. Leave it to me, it's my turn. Leave it to me. We're not Osma. Durin. Oh my god, is that Dogi?
Where is he now? <laughs> large blue haired man you're right I, I can't believe I could have mistaken this guy for a dogie it's clearly not him he's looking pretty uh he's looking pretty handsome in this game I feel like I wonder where he is now Oh, hi. Stop misfortuning me. Wow, this place looks so cool. Look at this. This is a really cool looking town. It kind of reminds me of like... Ospio a little bit. Misfortune, cool character. Yeah, I have no idea if you're talking about like... I, I have no idea which Misfortune you're talking about. <laughs> I, I, know, I, I know of a few, I know of like a few of them. I'm pretty sure. Girls, okay, okay. That's kind of what I assumed you were talking about, but I wasn't sure. Oh, I did not mean to skip that dialogue, I was just holding down B. No, <laughs> I was holding down B to run. Are you nervous? My name is Frida. I'm a warrior of this village who retells stories of the ancient past. Welcome, Adolf. I know you've had a long journey. Fairy. It didn't. It didn't really look like a fairy to me at first, because maybe because of her like gills. But I guess she's an alchemically created fairy. Leaking information. To these people, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how to feel about like select the VA. I mean I like I ki I kinda like it because it like you hear you hear the character's voice and then you can read the rest of the dialogue in that character's voice, but it's like it, it is kinda it's, it is a little weird.
<laughs> it's dreadful. Dude, Durin, Durin gets so much shit <laughs> from everybody. <laughs> I kind of feel bad about being so mean to him in dialogue options. Unforgivable sin. Oh, I can make the uh, the text box disappear. I'll just feel like go all the way then. Yeah, but I I can I can I kind of get it. Like, it's hard to record so many lines, right? Maybe not hard, but it costs more. <laughs> I'm sure Frida would win. <laughs> Sorry, Duran. I really like the uh, the music here. It's really nice. I never really felt like, um, like for me personally, VA doesn't really slow the pacing just because like when I'm well, when I'm playing like on my own at least, I tend to just go through the dialogue at my own pace anyways, <laughs> without caring too much about the dialogue. But maybe that's just me. When I'm on stream, I'll probably listen to everything. But yeah. By the way, does my stream look right? Okay. It just looks a little buggy on my OBS for some reason. <laughs> Is this your girlfriend? Yeah, I, I do feel some. I do feel bad about skipping VA sometimes, but I'm a, I'm a uh, common. Uh, I, I don't know the words for it. I, I do it a lot, basically. <laughs> Hang in there. Let's give him a beating. Of 
Gong Yu. That is an interesting name. It's almost like Korean sounding. This guy says he'll do whatever he can to help, but I can't actually buy from him right now. Unlucky. This must be like an al alchemy lab or something. I don't know what the heck is going on, but we have to stop. Wouldn't hit the same. True. I don't know why, but when I, whenever I see that line, it's like so funny to me. So I had to make an entire like stupid meme video about it. Nefarious purposes. This guy's a little suspicious, guys. Misfortune status uh, <laughs> prevented me from uh, shopping. I see, I see. Is Frida's house? I guess it's not Frida's house. Oh, this house does look kind of nice, actually. Like, if I was like living alone, I feel like this would be kind of a nice place to live. I mean, obviously, like, I would probably want like a bathroom and stuff, but like, I don't know. It's kind of cozy. I like this place. Yeah, I approve, I approve. We haven't even seen Frida's house yet. Oh, what's going on here? Okay, okay. Imagine a Rita's check on first strike. Yeah, a little bit. Is this Frida's house? I doubt it. <laughs> This looks a little pretty grand, holy moly. Okay, there's no way these books are organized, right? There's too many. Too many bookshelves. You know, I haven't really been to like a library in a really, really long time. I guess I'm not much of like a book reader though.
This, this is just bully during the video game at this point. Leave him alone. I don't remember if this library is real. What does that mean? Oh, we can't go up to the top. I guess it would just be, um... A lot of books. <laughs> this is just book tower, basically. Can you, like, like, what's up with this? Can you, like, the books are, like, covered by the stairs. You can't even pull the books out. This is the worst library ever. <laughs> yeah, this is a fake, fake library. Oh, wait, no, this, this will be Frida's house, right? Because this is, um... This is her mom. For some reason, I thought they like lived separately. For some reason, I don't know why. <clears throat> it looks like we've seen just about everything here. Yep. So we can go to that village over now. Is that like a, is that a frog? It's a big frog. Verde. Give it some liquid. Maybe they'll like filthy liquid. Okay, sorry. Let's go talk to Banjo. Banjo? Banjo and Kazooie? I have a lot of questions. Why does he look so evil? He has no eyebrows. I mean, I'm not saying that if you have no eyebrows, you're evil, but like... It, it, it does make you look kind of intimidating, in my opinion. I'd be evil if I lost my eyebrows. Hmm, I see. <clears throat> this guy seems pretty chill though, so far. Maybe he was able to overcome the um, mental shock of losing his eyebrows. Truly, uh, a villain like the making of a villain arc or something.
I suppose we'll let you off. I mean, Duran definitely wasn't like malicious or anything, so. Or at least not that malicious. I guess it depends on what what these guys are like really after. More deceitful than anything. Pretty easy to forgive Durin here, I think. Mask of the Sun? Are they are they are they the one who took it? It looks like a mask, yeah. They dug up my grave. They're gonna break through it. <laughs> Where to read the Akashic records where the bird's blueprints are recorded? Hmm. Interesting. I really thought like the Mask of the Sun would be this this makes more a lot more sense. But I really thought the Mask of the Sun would like allow people to like mind control their people or something just because like the masks were like the other masks were put on people to like control them. My theory was wrong. she even get here? How did you get here? I guess that's how she got here. She answered my question. The white Galbalon. Huh. That's a... Not a name I expected to see. <laughs> mm.
I wonder what the connection is. I have many questions, and Lisa is answering none of them. <laughs> Access the menu. Nice. I, I kind of I do want to try out uh, Frida here. That sounds fun. Leave everything to me. Skills. Oh, she has so many. Time to kill the white Kalvalon, I guess. Oh my god. Wow, that's cool. Maybe they're just maybe they're just making Galvalons now. Frida has like a halberd, she's so cool. The 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 name of the the name of the boss got me kinda shook, I won't lie. <laughs> It is a it is a Galvalon. They're just they're just meant there's just a lot of them now. No. Thank goodness. Of course. He just comes in and snatches it. This is like such a this is such a Falcom moment. <laughs> also, oh, he's one of these. Pe he's one of these people. He's not a Roman at all. Wait. Hereby refer to ourselves as Darklings. I don't really like that name. <laughs> yeah. What's a darkling? So now this guy can just see everything to have ever happened and ever will happen now. Lisa. I guess we're screwed. 
It's all your fault. She literally, she literally flew in here with a gavel on, so she could hand over the mask of the sun to Greta. Holy! I kind of respect it though. Sounds like the Akashic Records are in a physical location. Oh, I see. <clears throat> I thought if he had the Mask of the Sun, he could just do that now. Gamelons are created using a forbidden technology. Our ancestors sealed away. Where did the technology come from, though? Perhaps the Akashic Records? I, I feel like it'd have to be. So I wonder if Galvalon, like the, the original Galvalon from Oath, was also created in Celsetta. Although I don't completely remember what Galvalon's lore in Oath was. But he did look super technological, so... He was also the Alpha and the Omega. I've gone rogue and been sealed by locals? Could be. <laughs> My arch enemy, Galvalon. I'm glad we get some background about him though. It's kinda it's, it's kinda cool. Mr. Beast. That's so true. I'm pretty sure they. I'm, pre I'm pretty sure that they just wanted to put more Galvalons in East lore to give o the uh, Oath and Thelgana players a PTSD. That's my theory. Okay, so that's where the Akashic records are, and they can't even get in because the door is sealed. Nice. It's working, true. I'm interested in more learning more about uh, Frida and Duran's like backstory. They seem to have like some history, I guess. Because they keep talking about like another character. The character who whose home is now vacated. 
I'm pretty sure at least. <laughs> Indeed. I, 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 want, I want my own Galvalon too, that looks so cool. Can we get an East game where we can have our own Galvalon? Thank you very much. That's so cool. Actually, no. <laughs> I can now accept quests and go then. That was pretty quick. We usually can't uh, accept quests that quickly. Let me go to this party for now. Alright. Wait. First, let's get persevere for now. Let's get them. Don't hurt. Let's don't stay. Don't let's hurt. Don't stay out of their. Let's let's stay out of their. Don't let them so, get away. Had to test that one out. Brought the action barriers or plot piece in this game. It's a favorite device of mine. It is pretty cool. I don't. I actually feel like I don't see it too often in the forms of media I consume. But it, it it is pretty cool. And Andorola. That's an interesting word to pronounce. Increase my luck. Mikuri, person who wants to be happy. Hello, Jaden. So you got the final character? Is Frida the final character? You can synthesize- you can use materials to synthesize medicinal items. Interesting. Sounds nice. You're not allowed to say. Hopefully you have all of these. He has he needs so many. Oh my god. Wrote a leaf. I have zero of those somehow. Recovers all HP or vice fall now. Nice. Rota leaves seem to be pretty strong. Oh, Rota fruit. I actually have zero flowers. How do I get flowers? Do I have any good luck accessory? I'll show you this one. Sure. Enigma tablet. What does this even do?
Has a different effect every time. Okay, so it's just RNG statuses, I guess. Interesting. There's the missions over here. You know, I, I feel like the run is faster, but I'm, I have such a like habit of just um, only rolling everywhere. This is what happens when you get, they give you the roll too late. Maybe I should try out some skills on Frida. Force a drop item from the enemy's grip. Interesting. Raise the party's strength. That seems pretty good. Oh, How'd I get here? Wow, she's so cool. I'm a really big fan of like pole arms. So Frida is pretty cool in my opinion. Definitely my favorite kind of weapon. Melee weapon at least, for the pull arm. They're, I think they're super cool for some reason. Spears, halberds, stuff like that. Although I think my favorite pull arm would probably be a glaive. Glaives are so cool. Oh my god! Oh! That's that. Skills are Estelle-like? A little bit. Leave it to me! Soul Biter. That's a big strength increase, actually. Probably want some of this in my life. Kind of low on the monies. These are all cost of one, one G's. Right, surely I can afford to sell some of these. some coal? I feel like I probably should upgrade defense a little bit. Hmm. <clears throat> 
everything costs so much in this game. All the weapons and armor cost so much, at least. It's over here. Hang on. Ashen Forest. Ooh, this place is kind of cool, actually. How did these guys get here? That's what I'm saying. These guys are actually pretty impressive. They they've like they've gone everywhere we've gone. Yet they're totally fine. Oh. We should work together. Fishers. Free to cover his gas blowing fissures with icy magic. Cool. <clears throat> so we do like take damage in here or something? Doesn't look like it. I was kinda I was no. concerned about that. But it looks like we're fine. You know, I don't play a lot of Vita games, so I don't know what Vita games normally look like, but I feel like um, they did a pretty good job with the, like, environments and such. At least I like them. Oops. Pressing the wrong button. Stuff we got a lot of AoE. Feels pretty fun. Can I break this? That's fine. I didn't want it anyways. I definitely need to play more Vita games, for sure. Just because. Uh, I haven't even played the, the Vita Tales of game, so I mean, perhaps I will stream those games at some point. Maybe I should have bought some items, actually. Uh, I'm sure we'll be fine. What is Gravity Rush? I've actually never heard of it. <clears throat> Easy. 
is Durin. Leave it to me, my turn. <laughs> Immovability, though. Wow, girl can ma manipulate gravity. Very fluid gameplay. I see. Is it like a platformer? That sounds pretty fun. Can't be knocked back during skills. I see. Put Karna for now. Back to the Kalilika grind set. I actually, I actually love Kalilika <laughs> playing her at least. She feels very, she feels really fun. Hold on, let me do this, guys. That won't stop me though. I don't know. Now I need Frida. Pose will keep you in. Right, leave everything to now. I, I kinda like I kinda like the Kalilika Karna comp, I won't lie. What's going on over here? This one's top. I guess it's nothing. Also, I should equip my spirit cape again. And then it's photosynthesize, hopefully. Action platformer. I see, I see. Sounds cool. Interconnect and hub area to do story side quests and find hidden enemies. Okay, I actually love, I actually really, really like hub worlds and platformer games. I don't know why, but it is so nice to me. Like, my favorite examples are probably like Sonic Adventure and Mario 64. I don't know, like a good a good hub world is just so nice. Here again, I see. I know where I am. Can I get through here somehow? Like, what is this? 3D action adventure you basically is for floating city shifting gra gravity on them, falling up upward sideways, and, and so on. It's actually fun. Interesting. That sounds actually really fun. Maybe I should take a look at it. I'm a big platformer fan, even if I'm completely horrible at them. <laughs> oh my god, they're juggling me. I guess that should be expected. Ooh, I like that a lot. I got a hurricane. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Kaiser pushing, nice. Am I 
ready to heal. Stay out of their way. Kalika does not care. I don't know why. Normally I would like not like standing still to heal, I feel like. But in these games I'm just like... These games are so action-packed that sometimes it's nice to just... chill out. Don't let them get away. Like nor normally, I would not like say anything about like, oh my god, I love doing nothing in video games. It's so fun. But like, honestly, like at least it's like it feels it feels nice for me. I don't know. Very nice. I'll give that to you. Plus 45 defense. Actually, something I was kind of curious about is if you guys like, if you guys are like, really like into like chill games, like, for example, like farming games. Because I was, I was kind of curious if like, like I mean, a lot of people who are on, like, watch this channel, right? But like people who like to play action games. So I was curious if like people who like to play action games and stuff also like to play, like, play chill games. I like in games where you choose to take take in a moment instead of the game forcing you to slow down and show you. Yeah, I agree. I think I think those are like the best kinds of moments. I like vibe games where you just need to have some kind of hook. hook. That's understandable, I'd say. I definitely have a hard time getting into most of them, but some of them, if if you can get me into it, I'll like play, I'll like no life it. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, it's so good. Like, I remember uh, like when I was a little kid, I played a bunch of like Harvest Moon on the GameCube. More MMO for a good chunk of my life, so yeah, I like chill. Hmm, I see. Yeah, I must can be pretty chill. I definitely, when I did play MMO, that is Maple Story. <laughs> I think my favorite moments were just like chilling and chatting with people. So I, I get, I, I get that for sure. Oh, Rune Factory is actually really cool. It's actually a series I wanted to play more, but like... 
in, in, in the phase of my life where I was like trying to play it, I was like kind of too busy to fully enjoy it. So maybe I'll give it another try at some point. Weak to Pierce, where are you, Karna? What is this thing? Roto-Ruta! Alright, weak to strike. Get in your cloaca. Thunder Spears. Can I get him? So what's this red memory? This is kind of scary. I'll save first. Maple Story the Goat? I don't know about the goat, but... So it's not... It's actually not our memory, because... Adol would not know this, right? Maybe this is like Gruda's memory or something. Better than L Sword. <sighs> I agree. Although I did play a bit of L Sword when I was younger as well. Sharper than he looks. Here I go. Oh my God, I'm getting completely owned. I need to regen before I die to poison. I'll out regen the poison. And Karna's gone. Avoid the enemy. What is she doing actually? <laughs> she's uh she's having fun. see what she's doing over here. I guess she was looking at those enemies. Magical launcher. I just tried out some of these new skills I'm getting. I don't really like double impact that much. Interesting. Bit of a ranged attack. Do you have anything new? Shock Spark. Ooh, that's kind of cool. I like that. Here. 
Kalila kills him, no one answer that. <laughs> this area is not good for the AI, I see. Double impact kind of ebb. More of a third strike kind of guy. I see, I see. Karna's almost dead because she is spending her time trying to run after enemies. Instead of healing like the rest of us. Maybe it fits her character. Probably equip some like anti poison stuff. Yo, what's up, Hezzy? <laughs> Hezzy, my, my true goat. Goat of Lux, goat of eternal return. What can he not do? Went gym, nice. Come on, let's go. Oh, kind of a problem. Actually, something funny about that is like I was recording content with Stoven one, right? What Stoven ones, right? And I was like praising him and calling him a problem because that's like pretty common. Like, I, mean, I, feel, I feel like it's pretty common. People know like that's a compliment in like a League of Legends context. But like, he didn't know <laughs> that I was like complimenting him, and I called him a problem. And he's like, "What's wrong? What's wrong with me?" <laughs> and I felt kind of bad. Camp area. Very nice. <laughs> the brain rot is insane. It's like I don't even know how to describe it, but it's it's just like you're a problem, you know. <laughs> it's just it's just so natural to me. I was like, I, I I can't I couldn't even like fathom the fact that like being called a problem was like not a compliment. <laughs> I, I, it was actually it was like a culture shock for me. Battle. Yeah, also, I, I like to call, like, very aggressive gameplay psychopathic. Which is also pretty common in League. Racist movement, okay. I don't use that. I, I don't say that, but... Like, what's that even mean? <laughs> Hezzy's trying to make us look worse, actually. This is slander.
Okay, people do not describe things as racist in League. <laughs> At least I don't see that. <laughs> Actual slander. Le League of Legends slander. Memory fragments, huh? I wonder how many... I'm actually missing a lot. How do I get over there? Wasn't this area blocked off, though? Here I go. So what do I do about this? I can't get past this. I guess we can keep going over in this direction. This is actually the all-female party now. I don't like fighting these guys, to be honest. These guys are kind of annoying. This way. What is that? Madogras Slef. Oh my god, why that do so much damage? Is this like the super boss or what? <laughs> this is really the thing it is. It's gonna return for a very short amount of time. I can see that the Eternal Return community is uh, looking a little suspicious. This is so nice looking area. I love overgrown abandoned temples. <laughs> He's only 10 levels. Oh, was he 10 levels higher? No wonder he just one shot me. I've never been you I've never seen you be sus. Not once. Be careful, okay? Prioritize offense. Leave everything to me. Avoid the enemy. <laughs> I really don't like these like swimming dudes. They're, they're kinda hard to read, and I take a ton of damage and I get poisoned by them. I'm so curious, like, how do I get past this? There has to be a way. I think you can just have, like, no 
addle on your party. It feels so weird to me though. It's kinda cursed. Huh. Use a gamepad or a mouse to drop stones onto the pestle. The pestle will sink in accordance with how much weight is placed upon it. Oh my god. Another puzzle. Can I just... I don't get it. <laughs> Wait, what am I doing? Do I need to have it like at a specific height or something, or I need to push it like all the way in? Or does it need to be like balanced or something? What just happened? I'm not gonna question it. I'm a genius. <clears throat> I'll leave it at that. I like how I've solved the last two puzzles on complete accident. This is a boss. I think I should have saved. The puzzle was the lamp, the ring with the vase. Oh, I see. Yeah, that kind of makes sense. Master of the Grotto, Ribby Roy. God, crit plus strength up. <laughs> well, you did one damage. kind of a fun fight just because there's so many enemies, it's kind of fun to just... It's kind of fun to just hit all of them. You good, bro? I mean, I guess I did kill him, but... Oh my god, golden chest. What if it's a mimic? That'd be such a power move by these guys. Okay, no. Oh, I see now. So now we can well, now we can destroy those things. Oh, well, thanks, I guess. Let me try this out, actually. I guess I can't. I guess it's not like an action, I just bump into things. Maybe can disguise themselves as any object they like. It could be a whole house if you are. Is that real? That's kind of cool. Oh, items.
Can I talk to these guys? Are, aren't these guys speaking the Rue language? Oh, no, they're kind of, it look, kind of looks like uh, English, actually. It just says, I am Ribby Roy, and then something. As long as the thing they transform into isn't moving, they can work into it. Really? That's kind of cool. I like that. They, I, I feel like, I think more games should actually do stuff with that. <laughs> with that concept. It's like, damn, this is this rock? That's a mimic. Oh, wait, I, I can charge. I see. This door here about to open? Mimic. That's some like Ocarina of Time shit. Alright, Adol, get back in here. We need you, the pro tag. You're like Prey 2017 then. What what is Prey? Is that a game? FPS, the whole concept revolves around mimics. Hmm, interesting. Come on. Might have to give it a look. I'm no good at shooters, though. Nice guy. Oh, hi. <laughs> I go every time we come out of memory, there's enemies waiting for us, and we just murder them. Arc Blast. Oh my god. This reminds me so much of Custom Robo. Um, no one's gonna get this re reference, but if you've ever played the Javelin Robo and Custom Robo on the GameCube, this is literally his charge. Custom Robo is really fun. I've only played the one on the GameCube, but it is one of my favorite GameCube games, actually. I don't know how well it's aged. It's been a while since I've played it, but man, when I played it when I was younger, I thought it was so fun.
Replay stream? Maybe, maybe. Kazuro was so fun though. I, I definitely recommend. A shipwrecked or thrown in jail again. When did we get thrown in jail? We never got thrown in jail, right? Maybe East One? Oh, he, it was East One. He broke us out of jail, right? I guess, I guess we were in jail. Well, I will say I definitely prefer <clears throat> just dashing normally. Because you're rolling. True. You'd imagine. Actually, Legend of Zelda was the first Souls like. Halberd plus five. I'll take it. It's almost like heavy inspiration. You know, that's actually pretty true. Now that I've played um, a Legend of Zelda game and played, and also I've played Dark Souls, they are actually. I, I can definitely see the influence for sure. Plus three. Uh, I'll just give it to Karna. She has the least. Aside from Zelda 2, is it that hard? Oh my god. I guess I really hate that one worm. Sorry. Zelda 2 is brutal, but not unfair. I see, I see. Hey, just because it's hard doesn't mean I like it, okay? <laughs> Although it might seem that way. This thing. Now. This is gonna come to life and keep like, oh my god, it's the black Galbalon. <laughs>
Actually, I should have given that guy my uh, Silver Axe earlier. Unlucky. I made the wrong choice. Making a golden axe series? I don't even know what golden axe is. <laughs> I only know golden sun. Sega beat him up. It's not good in my opinion, huh? It's like by series, like, do you mean like a new game? Or like a TV show or something? <laughs> Indeed. Oh, I didn't realize. The characters had their own camp lines like that. Pretty neat. Honestly, I'm surprised they haven't done a Yakuza TV series. Maybe they have, I just don't know about it, but that seems like so obvious. Supofanga, what a name. Full times 100. <laughs> the Yakuza TV show. Yeah, I mean, I feel like a Yakuza TV show would do so well. Never play a Yakuza game myself though. Golden Axe seems like a very weird decision because I don't even know how people know about that series, like that game at this point. Thirty-year-olds know about it. I don't know how much you want to market towards uh, thirty-year-olds, though. Kalilika is going crazy again. Ooh. 
I'm assuming that's House of the Dead. I didn't know they were gonna re remake House of the Dead too. That's interesting. Look, I got some new skills. Gold Rush, Thunder Spears, Gravity Spear. Let's try Thunder Spear. Oh, what is this? Oh, if I... I can, like, send it out. That's so cool, actually. I love that. The cloak is so cool. She might be my goat. Yeah, I'll do some healing. Kind of low. Since the second announcement a while back, House of Devs on the list of series getting new games. Oh, nice. I'm surprised. I, I guess I just don't really hear a lot about House of the Dead in uh, the modern day. But I guess I also never heard of Golden X. Maybe I'm just ignorant. Maybe I'm just a fake Sega fan. Only play Sonic. <laughs> Frida is like, this one's tough. I think I've I think I've seen Golden Axe. I just didn't recognize the name. I'm not really a big like. I'm not. I'm not really a big beat 'em up kind of guy. I don't know why. It's been a while since I played one, but I can never really like super get into them. like a boss area. I'll just put these on for fun. There's that thing. Deform Nightmare. Mustrum. Oh, 
that's healing him, I see. Frida definitely has the best AoE. He's uh, crawling. Uh, there's not really CC, I would say. I mean, I guess there's like, uh, there's there's freeze. I, I would say that's CC, but I don't know if it really works on bosses. But bosses usually have like states. Oh Jesus. Bosses usually have like states where they're like vulnerable. Oh, he's too fast. Like right now. Oh, I killed him for there! <laughs> I'm so smart. <laughs> that was actually that was actually really cool. Perfectly countered. Finishing off enemies in creative ways. It's so fun. Adel's just here to collect memories now. He's been benched. Ruse? These are Ruse, right? Yes, they're definitely Ruse. They're making some very interesting noises as well.
I have no idea what is going on here. I mean, they could be hungry. All the all the Roos in East Origin are really hungry for Rota fruits. This is quite possibly the most informative memory Adol has received. Oh my god, there's a huge one over there. Look at that big boy. Maybe this is the hungry one. He has like, all his food. His fruits. This guy looks like he could be in like Ocarina of Time or something. Yeah, he gives me some Zora King energy. Ah, I feel like we're gonna have to, we're gonna like translate this in memory at some point. That that was way too long to just be nothing. Actually, this charge is a lot like the charge in Oath and Felgana as well. Thinking about it. Obviously, no iframes, but you can spam it like that. Ancient Battlefield. Oh, banger. I'll laugh at that being meant nothing in the grand scheme. Honestly, it probably won't. How can a bow with a human being cause this much devastation? Using forbidden technology for a good cause, I think it's not the worst. I guess it did cause a lot of destruction though. <laughs> Sword Raid, kind of. I 
panic when we go attack there. Chilling in the ancient battlefield. Nice. Man, this music's so good. Falcom exploration themes always go hard. Did I not like full heal or something? I'm sorry. <laughs> Okay, it's only an unforgivable sin. Hmm. I see. I must be a darkling. I'll 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 atone for my sins here. Let's get moving. Let's get moving. I'm at 100 HP. Chill out. No, not Dark Link, but Dark Ling in this game. <laughs> Dark Link would be... Uh, I it would be fun to be Dark Link, though, maybe. There you go. 1486. We did it. This is so wide open. about this game actually is how much it encourages flash guard and flash move. Just because of how beneficial they actually are in terms of like gameplay. Because like crits and slowing time is actually so huge. And so it like really incentivizes like good gameplay over just like playing like super safe I think. It's also just more fun if you just play for like flash guards and stuff. So I'm glad it does that. I'm trying to experience. I'm, I'm starting to appreciate this game's combat like a lot more. I that like a lot of like skills and stuff to work with. At the beginning, I wasn't feeling it too much, but now I'm like, yeah, now I think it's like really fun. Oh, 
Love fact about the water health fight, his health is actually whatever yours in. Oh my god, wait, I, he was not ready to face me because I had I have no hearts. <laughs> I countered him. Eight on PC is also co-op. Yeah, I actually heard about that. I heard it was co-op. Or that it has a co-op thing, at least. That sounds pretty interesting, for sure. I wonder how good it is. It was added retroactively because of the original PC launch. Hmm, I see. You know what game would be really interesting to add uh, co-op to? I think East Origins would be fun to add co-op into. Because they have like three playable characters in it. Can't clean with it. Sages Diadem? <laughs> I'm not sure if I pronounced that right. Okay, obtained XP. Very nice. I give it to Adolf for now, just because he's kind of fell behind the level a little bit. Compared to Frida and Karna, at least. Oh god. I thought we all just died for a second. <laughs> Let's get out of here. the bench at all for the uh for the good comp. Let's get moving. Actually I'm kinda curious just oh, Sonis, do you have like a favorite East game? I know you've played like a lot of them, but I don't think I've ever asked you which one your favorite is. But I'm kind of curious. Actually, this place might be fun to use Gale Shoes in. It's so wide open. Let's do it. Overall, Oath Napishtim or Monstrum Nox? Hmm, I see. I'm really excited to play Mo uh, Napishtim. In particular. Oh, this guy's just not a boss. He's just a gatekeeper. Are you playing East 5? 
That's a good question. I don't know if I'm, I don't know if I'm going to play this fight. It's a Galva! This guy's the weakest Galvalon I've ever seen! Okay, I guess we can't kill him now. Hmm. I know that East 5 is like the um, <laughs> the black sheep of the series, which it, it, I won't lie, it does kind of interest me, but I, I don't know if I, if I want to play. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. Oh, I'm busy or something. He's the beta and the gamma. Unlucky. Let's see, what is this? Ice pillar. Ice pillar. Oh, I see. There's a blue thing over there. really cool. It, it does not have the greatest reputation, I must admit. Which is kind of what makes me hesitant to play it. And I've seen like a little bit of gameplay of it, it just doesn't look like what I... It doesn't really look like a game I would like super enjoy. So I don't know. I might just go to... I might just go to 6. That being said, I did hear it short, so maybe I'll... just try and knock it out in like a few streams. Could, could be the play. I would feel bad about missing some lore. Because I actually quite like, um, I, I quite like East lore. Duke the Ruin Capital. Stealth section? It's a rota tree.
Oh shit, it's Remnos. He's just here. I guess I can't explore too much here. I mean, how cool would you have to be to actually just roll that many times in a row? Like, can you imagine how dizzy you'd be? Oh my god, this is a puzzle. <laughs> so let's open the door. Oh. <laughs> Someone who has tried very dizzy, I see. Actually, I remember like when I was uh, really young, I had to do some rolls because I was like um, I was in like a wrestling wrestling class actually, and we had to do some rolling. And it was like the only time I ever rolled. But it was kind of fun, actually. <laughs> I enjoyed it. Would roll again. Ex fiance. And that's probably who they're always talking about. Oh, they're all here. <laughs> if he really had to zap us to make, make room for himself to land. Yeah, this is a total, this is a very Falcom moment. <laughs> hmm. 
I mean, El Deal might know how to open the door. Maybe it just opens when you have the Mask of the Sun on. Perhaps that's what it responds to. He's the Phantom Thief B. Actually true. <laughs> he looks like another character. Maybe, <laughs> I don't think, I'm not thinking of Phantom Thief B. I, I feel like... He reminds me of somebody else. I don't know who though. Get in there. I don't I don't think I don't think I'm thinking of a trails character. So now we're really screwed. <laughs> they have the Mask of the Sun and they know where the Akashic records are. Still just standing over there after hearing all that commotion. I guess, uh. Oh, it's the ruse! Time. Actually, there's a chest over there, though. I might go grab that. Karna sent something nearby. It'd be nice to, it'd be wise to investigate. This one, the chest, man. That's teasing me. Why do they just blame Durant immediately? <laughs> These people are toxic. Shop. Roost nest. I feel like I've seen East do this quite a few times, where they're just like, Yeah, you can't get that chest until you progress the story. We have bigger fish to fry. 
That's just such a funny thing to say. I don't know why. It's probably the tree. I can actually buy from these people? I mean, these ruse. Maybe I'll buy this for Karna? And this for Kalilika. It's a 96 increase. I feel like it's pretty big. <clears throat> I'm glad I don't have to listen to him snore anymore, at least. This guy probably. I thought it was the road achievement. It's probably just this thing. The biggest Rue of all time. Well, I didn't say anything, but I really like Frida's uh, design. She's really cool. Her having a halberd just makes her like two times cooler. It's a multiplier. was a bit touched in the head. A twin mask, huh? Is it the mask of the moon? Oh, it is. I, I guess it's like... I, I thought it was maybe too obvious for them to do it. Oh, you already, you already have a cell set up? Nice. Yeah, this game's pretty fun. I, re I would recommend it. I enjoyed it, at least. Mount Vesuvio! I wonder what that one's based off of. Does this mean Celceta, the ancient kingdom of Celceta, is just Pompeii? Although I guess it wasn't destroyed by Mount Vesuvio, but... These games on Steam, you get around to them. I want to try the TG16 version 1 too. 
What is it? Well, I don't even know what TG16 is. But yes, the older older East game OST is so good. Yuzo Koshiro the goat. Turbo Graphic 16, I see, I see. Sacred Beast Color. When equipped, turns party members into ruse, allowing them to communicate with other ruse. In addition, beasts and monsters will not attack. I see. Let's go. All right, leave it to me. Let's go. Become ruse. How do I become a ruse? Oh, here we go. Can you rewatch memories? I think you can. Day in the life of a Roo. I wonder if I could understand it if I am a Roo currently. Leave everything to me. Everybody has a unique Roo design too. Let's check them out. Let's go. This is Karnak. Okay, I see, I see. They're all so cute. <laughs> Leave it to me. Leave it to me. Leave it to me. I don't do classic. Do they all have unique names? Fruda! <laughs> I guess it does sound like fruit. Karuna, I don't know. Karuna. I kinda like that name, actually. Let's check out the other Rue names. I don't even know how you'd change Ozma into a Rue name. Ozru. Ruzma. It is Ruzma. Okay, that, that actually makes sense. That's a curly name. Leave it to me. Darun. I don't know. I don't know about that one. That's a bit of a stretch. Yeah, it's a bit, it's a bit strange. Dude, even the Ruz are bullying him. Karurika. <laughs> Karuruka! Oh my god. I was pretty close. Two Ruse in her name. <laughs> Arustodal. <laughs> I don't know why this is funny to me. <laughs> okay. Arrogant. I'm feeling ornery. Embarrassed. Would my my um my my rune name would probably be like Horungi. Stoven would be like Ruven or something. I don't know. Runins. Struven. Maybe that could work too. Druzy. Rucifer. Oh. 
this guy's a memory? Hey, it's these two. Rabbit and somebody. Pigeon, right. very healthy relationship these two have. <laughs> Curious if I, this will work. Oh, my God, it does work. Wait, it is a stomach. <laughs> I think you might be a genius. Ruinous! What a name. You're definitely a genius, Mr. Zelos. <laughs> Airboxing. <laughs> I, I love Aristotle. Aristotle. That's my goat. I just realized she has like a little bag. That's interesting. I guess it's because her name is like supposed to be like Purse, but it's like Pruce. <laughs> what 
What an interesting memory. Pro is because you're the chair box. Oh, that makes sense too. I thought it was supposed to be like purse, because she has a purse. <laughs> What's going on over here? What is this icon? The real question is, can I talk to the enemies like I could before? Doesn't look like it. We're peaceful ruse now though. But not for long. I'm back. Dude, I love that combo. It's a spark shot into a napalm shot. That's so cool. Game though is that um, at least from what I've seen, none of the bosses have weaknesses or resistances. So you can use whatever character you want on the bosses, even though there are like obviously like resistances, weaknesses in the overall for like normal enemies. Is I per I personally like it. Just because, you know, you want to be able to use the character you like in the boss way. At least that's how I see it. Probably watch this memory and then call it a day, because I'm pretty tired actually tonight. <laughs> Look, I woke up too early. I do remember saying something like how Durin and Gruta like recognize each other. I was right. That'll probably be it for today. Um, I feel like I wasn't as chatty as usual because I was a little bit tired, but hopefully that's okay. But thank you for watching either way. I still had fun, so 
yeah, I hope everybody has a good night. Goodbye, everybody.